Hey, it's Clam Ham. What has been going on off the coast of South Africa this week? Seriously, let's take a look what was seen by satellite imagery on this website, ventasky or ventasky.com. Now this is showing April the 9th. I'm going to show you some close-ups of this. Check out what appears the next day. What? Look at this. You see how big this is? This is enormous. I mean, this is the size of this area of South Africa itself. This is enormous. I'm going to show you some stuff about this. And we're going to take a deeper look at what was seen and what people think it was or was not. It was billed as the size of Texas, this strange anomaly. Headlines included the alien wave anomaly. People thought even a black hole or UFO. Viral TikToks were shot where the waves were going backwards with this extreme wind. Multiple news sources documented severe weather conditions. So here we are. If we go back, this is what it looked like. We're going back in time and there it is on April the 10th looking like this enormous 2,000 mile bug. Like this giant bug apparently with 80 foot waves but strangely no one caught video of these 80 foot waves. I did go through the different options on this site. Nothing else was abnormal except when you select waves. Those are the other options there. But look at the size of this. And of course, ripe for theories because it was heading out of Antarctica. Could it be a strange military cloaking device? Could it be experimental weapons or technology? The theories of what this might be, as you can imagine, really gripped people's imaginations. And frankly, I don't blame them. Apparently... Even more mysteriously, it disappeared so quickly. Now, this was not the first sighting of this anomaly. It was also seen February 25th this year by the same satellite imagery of Ventusky.com. This is what it looked like February 25th. So not such a singular blob but still incredibly peculiar nonetheless. Theories included a giant sea creature, a UFO moving underwater. So even more peculiar, NASA predicted an asteroid hitting at around the same time. But it would make a near miss, this asteroid 2024 GJ2. But if we check out this space modeling video, did it miss? 2024 GJ2, we put this into motion, it pretty much just goes right into the Earth, <laughs> no matter how I look at it. It appears the asteroid hit the Earth. What? Now, if we go back to that area, there is a fault line. Whether that could have something to do with it, I don't know. But here is the report put out by Ventusky.com. Despite numerous reports of UFOs or Atlanteans launching from the ocean, yesterday's image of giant waves near Africa was due to a model error. They apparently get their data from these guys. One thing's for sure, most of you did not agree with this response. This is 100% an error that's a fairly common shipping route and there hasn't been a single report from a vessel. Nope, massive alien craft. Love the comments, nobody believes this story, as they shouldn't. A model error would not show the propagation we see. Please explain the error in more detail. Multiple apps show the same error and we did have those reports of extreme ocean drawback and this crazy weather off the coast of South Africa. Let me know in the comments what you think. We'll be keeping an eye out. Take care.